Hello everyone. So today we are going to see about how to coat sepsis due to a post procedural infection. This is a topic which is coming under chapter 1 ICD 10 certain infectious and parasitic diseases. Under sepsis you have this topic that is sepsis due to post procedural infection. It is little bit confusing to understand like what all coat should be assigned. So here we will have a serious discussion about that, okay? So several questions must be answered before coding sepsis due to a post procedural infection. First question first question uh, was the procedure wa was it obstetrical is the site of the infection documented is the infectious agent documented is severe sepsis or acute dysfunction is present so if it is known that the procedure was non obstetrical okay and the site of infection is documented the primary code should be from t81.40 till t81.43 and the secondary code should be from sepsis following a procedure t81.44 and third code should be for sepsis a41.9 and finally if severe sepsis is present you can code that and next comes if the procedure was obstetrical and the site of infection is documented primary code should be o86.00 till o86.03 secondary code sepsis following obstetric procedure o86.04 third should be for sepsis and fourth code should be for severe sepsis associated with organ dysfunction if it is mentioned like if the infection is following a infusion transfusion or therapeutic injection in this case the primary code should be from t80.2 or if it is like uh, if it is due to an immunization the primary code will be t88.0 and the secondary code should be assigned from severe sepsis okay so in this way we will be coding i have given an example sepsis due to a post procedural infection coding a 52 year old male is admitted with sepsis due to post operative infection of small intestine following appendicectomy here the first code will be infection following a procedure t81.43 second sepsis following a procedure t81.44 and third is for sepsis and the next example is a patient underwent cystoscopy for diagnostic purpose 3 days later the patient is admitted with urosepsis due to uti caused by escherichia coli here the primary code is infection following that procedure t83.51 xa second you have given uti code and third for sepsis due to that organism so that's all about this uh, whole uh, topic hope so you all understood and if you need any sort of like interview preparation or interview guidance or cpc training cpc crash course you can join with us we will help you to learn medical coding very easily and in a very very simple way thank you so much for watching if you have been subscribed please do subscribe and watch uh, all our videos completely Thank you so much. Stay tuned. Take care. Bye bye.